Howdy folks, Jeff here, Certified Car Care Professional. I want to talk to you for a minute today about your tires. There's a lot of things you can look at at your tires, and a lot of times you can go to different places and they might tell you something about your tires. So what we have here is we have a new tire, we have here a tire that's a worn, and we have here a, a tire that's halfway in between. So what's the difference and what is it I want to tell you? Well, all of the tires have a built-in tread wear indicator. And what it is, is a mark on this one, and you can see the white line right here. And this is where the tread is worn down, and there's a tread wear indicator down there. And when that level is the same as the tread level, then that tire will not pass state inspection. It's actually unsafe, even though it looks like it has some tread here. And you, if this is on your car, and you think, oh, I don't need tires right now. I, I can get by. Well, if you have wet, if you have icy, snowy, anything like that, there's really not enough tread there for the tire to grab the road. If you have to slam on your brakes and stop real quick, there's not enough tread there. It's going to be like a slick tire because that tread wear indicator is worn. This tire needs to be replaced. So, Jeff, where's that on my tires? Well, on this new tire, I actually marked them, and you can see it way down in there. There's actually that tread wear indicators are spaced every so often on this tire. And I marked it there so that you could see it's barely visible on a new tire. Now we have another tire that's about halfway worn. So what do we want to look at on your tires in this case? It's not time for tires, but it is time to have these rotated. In other words, on the front of the car, tire wears a little bit more. Front wheel drive, it's also the steering. So that tire is going to wear a little bit more on the front than it will on the back. So that's why we rotate them. We bring the tire that's not worn as much off of the back and we put it up on the front and we put this one on the back. Why do we do that? Well, that way your tires will last a little bit longer and you don't have to buy tires quite as often because we try to get the most use out of them. If we just left this one on the front and let, the, let it wear down, you'd have a new tires on the back and then you'd have to be buying tires for the front. So we want to rotate them. And then what do we look at when we decide to rotate the tires and to see if your car needs alignment? Well, on this one, you can see I'm marked. And on this side, you can actually see where the little grooves are right here on the outside edge. On the inside edge, you can see how the chalk is almost solid because it's worn off those grooves that are already there. So what does that mean? Well, that means when we rotate these tires, then we need to get your car in for alignment and have it aligned so that your tires don't wear like that. So when you look at your tires, you can actually tell a lot of things about your car and a lot of things about the handling and, and the different items on it. So that's a little car care tip on tires today. As always, I appreciate you tuning in. If you can't get to my shop, go to a certified shop in your area. Thanks for watching.